Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Wa salatu wa salamu ala nabijina Muhammadin Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in Amma ba'd Fa'awudhu billahi minash shaitan rajim Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim Rabbi Ishrah li sadri Wa yasir li amri وَحَلُّلُ كَدَتَمْ مِنْ لِسَانِ يَفْقَهُ قَوْلِ رَبِّي زِدْنِي إِلْمًا أَجْمَعِينَ إِنْشَاءَ اللَّهِ May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increase in all of us knowledge. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Alhamdulillah, we are going to analyze Surah number 93, Surah Duha, a very beautiful Surah. Inshallah, you will love it. I enjoyed collecting all the information and I would like to present it to you. I read many books in order to make my notes. And whatever I like from different books, I include it in this. So I hope you will all love it. You will like it. I enjoyed collecting everything for you to enrich your knowledge and get better understanding of the words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Supreme eloquence of the words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the speech of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, and that is the Quran. The Quran will remain the source of guidance for all mankind till the end of time. There will be no other book to come, no other prophet to come, except we have the Quran, which is our guide which is something we look forward to every day, every day, every day. When we pray our salah, we talk to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now all that thing that I'm talking to you will only come if we know the language. So it is extremely important for every Muslim to learn Arabic. It is never too late to learn Arabic. So inshallah, and those of us who come to the class, uh, you will continue to come every Sunday inshallah, so that you can keep on increasing your knowledge, your understanding, and your sawab that you get by learning the different verses of the Quran. So now, I start Surah Duha, the forenoon, the forenoon. This is an early Makkan Surah. The main theme is Risala, messengership of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam and the Quranic Wahi, yes. That is the main theme. It, It negatives the opposition of the unbelievers who, in view of a temporary pause in the coming of Wai to him, started taunting him that his Lord had forsaken him. See, this is very important to understand that there was this delay in receiving the new wahi to our prophet. So they started, unbelievers started taunting him, the prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. 
that his Lord had forsaken him. He abandoned him. It is stated that this was not at all so. It is stated in the verses that this was not at all so. He is also reminded the Prophet of Allah's past favors on him and is encouraged to carry on his mission and work and is assured of ultimate success and happiness. Very important. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is reminding uh, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam of past favors on him, Allah's past favors on him, and is and he is encouraged to carry on his mission and work and is assured of ultimate success and happiness. The surah is named after the first ayah in which Allah swears by the forenoon, the light, the, and the night to two, two swearing, huh? forenoon, bright morning sunlight, and the night. Huh? We'll understand it, inshallah. <clears throat> Sister Iman Torres, Al Hanif, UK. This surah was revealed in the early days of Prophet's mission, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. This swad is Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. The surah was revealed in the early days of the Prophet's mission. During a period when he was worried and the angel did not come with any new revelations for some time. Yes. So Prophet Wasallam started worrying that the angel Jibreel alayhi salam, did not come with his, any new revelation for some time. The unbelievers of Makkah started to tease and taunt the Prophet. The unbelievers of Makkah started to tease and taunt the Prophet وسلم, saying that your God has abandoned and forsaken you. That your God has abandoned and forsaken you. So the first section, 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 the first section begins by assuring him that everything would turn out well in the end. The first section begins by assuring him that everything would turn out well in the end. The second section reminds the Prophet that Allah had helped him out of many troubles before. Yes. The second section reminds the Prophet وسلم, that Allah had helped him out of many troubles before. The beloved messenger of Allah was burdened by the death of his father, mother, his grandfather in his early childhood. Allah provided him, although the care of his uncle and later through his marriage to the wealthy widow Khatija, his first wife. First wife, you know. So, <clears throat> From a different beginning, from a difficult beginning, from a difficult beginning, Allah raised him to a position of fame. At first, because of his honesty and good character, this is very important. And later, through his mission to humanity. From a difficult beginning, Allah raised him to a position of fame. At first, because of his honesty, alamin, and good character. Yeah, this is so very important for us to understand and realize that Allah made him an example for the humanity in good character. It will all come, inshallah. I've got it all written down. 
and later through his mission to humanity. All from Iman Torisa, it ho often happens that people with humble beginning become corrupted when they rise to high positions of power and fame. This is common with human beings. It often happens that people with humble beginnings become corrupted when they rise to high positions of power and fame. Many wealthy businessmen who began their careers as a poor shoe shiner on the street or a newspaper boy forgot their simple origins after they joined with the rich crowd. I hope you got it, huh? inshallah. I'll re re read it again. It often happens that people with humble beginning become corrupted when they rise to high positions of power and fame. Many wealthy businessmen who began their careers as a poor shoe shiner on the street or a newspaper boys forgot their simple origin after they joined with the rich crowd. They began, they begin to look down on people whom they think are lower than themselves and treat them badly. This attitude comes from their thinking that they have made their success, not realizing that they could never have achieved anything without the support and the grace of Allah. This attitude comes from their thinking that they have made their success, not realizing that they could never have achieved anything without the support and grace of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This surah was revealed before the Prophet's mission became successful. Remember, this surah was revealed before the Prophet's mission became successful. But Allah was instructing him and all the believers in advance to be very careful of their treatment of those more unfortunate than themselves. Very beautiful, my brother. This surah was revealed before the Prophet's mission became successful, but Allah was instructing him through Quran and all the believers in advance to be very careful of their treatment of those more unfortunate than themselves. The blessed Prophet was the best example of good treatment. The blessed Prophet وسلم, was the best example of good treatment. Even during his busiest period in Medina, he would always take time to personally attend to the needs of women and children, weak and poor. Yeah. Even during his busy time in Medina, busiest period in Medina, he would always take time to personally attend to the needs of women and children, weak and poor. He remained humble even when he was the leader of Arabia. You must remember, eh? he remained humble even when he, when he was the leader of all Arabia. And his own family often went, often went without food so that other, others could eat. Yeah. That is our prophet, my brothers and sisters. And his own family often went without food so that others could eat. Allah, all of us face problems. Right? Yes. Yeah. All of us face problems from day to day. But we should never forget Allah's kindness to us. Rather than comparing our lives to those of other people, 
who have more than we do, rather than comparing our lives to those of other people who have more than we do, we should compare our lives to those millions of people who have less, who have less, and we should be grateful, you know. Even if we live in a place where we never see a really poor person, yeah, Canada, USA, and Europe, even if we live in a place where we never see a really poor person or ever know an orphan, still there are always things we can do to help others who are less fortunate than ourselves. Still, there are always things we can do to help others who are less fortunate than ourselves. This surah was revealed to the Prophet but it concerns in a wider sense to all of us to console every faithful man and woman who is afflicted with sorrow and hardship. Yes, this surah was revealed to Prophet but it concerns in a wider sense to all of us to console every faithful, to console every faithful man and woman who are afflicted with sorrow and hardship. For us, it is always faith in Allah and patience. For us, it is always faith in Allah and patience our offering of five daily salat minimum and reciting the Quran with understanding, uh, understanding to find solace, solace and tranquility and remembering the example of our beloved prophet. Yes, Alhamdulillah. So here are something I have added for you to understand. Here are six gems of verses. This is extra. Here are six gems of verses. Surah Baqarah, verse 152 to 157. To remember and recite often, yes. To remember and recite often. I have memorized them, alhamdulillah. And I would recommend you to memorize and recite them often and sever the incredible eloquence of the miraculous words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now there are things that are connected with this. Huh? I want to t also tell you about this. <clears throat> Beautiful. Five verses, six verses. Ya, no, it starts with a big pardon. Faskuruni askurkum, washkuruli wala takfuruni. Allah is saying, if you remember, remember me, I will remember you. Yes, first we have to remember Allah, then He will remember us and thank me for all the blessings and never be ungrateful or kafara yakfuru to be ungrateful or also to reject reject not faith you know next verse ya ayyul lazina amanu istainu bis sabri was salat istainu bis sabri was salat inna allaha ma sabirin oh you who believe, seek help with patience and perseverance and prayers for Allah is with those who patiently persevere. 
يُقْتَلُوا فِي سَبِيلِ اللَّهِ يَمْوَاتِ بَلْ اَحْيَاءٌ لَكِنْ لَا تَشْعُرُونَ And say not of those who are slain in the way of Allah. They are, they are dead. Don't say that, that they are dead. Nay, they are living, though you perceive it not. Brother, this, this is a monumental message from the Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, from Quran. Don't say those who have been slain, who have been slain, fi sabilillah, amwatun dead. No, no, no. Bal, they are alive. Walakin la tashuruna. But you cannot perceive it. When I was studying this, I thought of the sacrifices of Imam Hussein in Karbala. They are alive with Allah, but we cannot perceive it, you know. They say something for all of us to remember. Yes, we are all going to be tested. No, this is Allah is swearing here. Huh? This is Nablu Wannakum. I swear. No, not I swear. We swear. Nablu Wannakum. Allah says, We swear. Nablu huh? Wannakum. That you will be tested with something. Bishayan means with something. Minal Khawfi wal Ju'i. Fear and hunger. Okay. Be sure we shall taste you, we shall taste you with something of fear and hunger. And then naksim means naksin means some loss in goods. Amwalikum. Lives and fusikum, samarati, the fruits of your toil, but clear tidings to those who patiently persevere. Babashir is sabirin, those who patiently persevere. Allazina ida asabat hum musibatu kaalu. Inna lillahi wa inna ilayhi rajiyoon. Who say when afflicted with calamity to Allah we belong and to Him is our return. Allah zina idha asabat hum musibatun. They are afflicted with, with, uh, with calamity, musibatun. Calamity, Kalu, they say, Inna lillahi wa inna ilahi rajiyun. This every time we hear about somebody's death, we say, Inna lillahi. We want to remind ourselves also. We are from Allah and we, ilahi rajiyun. This is Quran. We don't say, I'm from Allah and I'm going to return. No, we always, when we pray, we pray for everybody else. Inna lillahi. We are from Allah. Allah is teaching us. Wa inna ilahi rajiyun. Ilahi, he is Allah. Ulaika alayhim salawatu mir rabbihim. And they are the one, you know, they are those on whom descend Blessings from their Lord. Ulaika alayhim salvatu mir rabbihim wa rahmatum and mercy. Wa ulaika humul mohtaduna. 
and such are the ones in receipt of guidance. And it is they who are rightly guided. Motaduna, they are the rightly guided, or they receive, they are in receipt of the guidance, you know. So I thought I point out to you, and we all know Arabic. So once you know Arabic, brothers and sisters, I tell you from my experience, it is joy to memorize knowing Arabic. It is fun to memorize uh, because the Arabic language that we learn makes it easy and enjoyable to memorize. So here is something that I thought probably you know, probably you don't know. There was a very terrible incident in the New Zealand. I think it was Auckland, New Zealand. And some devilish person uh, martyred over 40 people. The whole world was shocked. Even the Prime Minister of New Zealand, she had a special session in the parliament. Huh? And in that parliament, Muslim brother beautifully recite all these verses. All these verses were beautifully recited. Huh? See, those slain was the devil of a person. He martyred over 40 people. Allah says, they are not, they are not dead. They are alive with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, but you do not per perceive it. Huh? So this is, was very beautifully read in the parliament of New Zealand with beautiful recitation of Quran in Arabic and translation, alhamdulillah. So I thought I should emphasize to remember all these verses. Try, try my brothers and sisters. I memorize it, I love it. I say in my salah, doesn't take too long. Now, there's another, another thing that I want to tell you. This is another surah. 68, Al-Kalam. Noon, Wal-Kalami. Huh? This is Vowel Qasam and Harfchal. Huh? This is Qasam, huh? Vowel Qasam and Harfchal. Vama Yastaruna. Also, this is another Qasam. And what you write with your pen, you know, Yes, Taruna. Noon, one word, one word. Huh? Noon. Look at it. When you talk about Kalam, Allah is using disjointed letter in the beginning. Noon. But that Noon looks like an ink pot. These are scholars say huh? that Noon looks like an ink pot. Ink, ink pot. Pot. Huh? import. In the olden days, they had ink, ink pots with the dip your uh, pen and write. So if this is your uh, kasam and kasam, no if, there's a jawabu kasam, these are all jawabu kasam. These are jawabu kasam. If there are jawabu kasam, brothers and sisters, and if it is negation, nothing is to be emphasized. Jawabu kasam needs to be emphasized. And we have a beautiful handout prepared by 
but the right name of Mitzvah Saga. Maybe I want to send it to you again. He had made that handout on October 2, 2012. Can you imagine? October 2, 2012. He made that handout. I'll send you again, inshallah. So if there is a negation, no need to emphasize. This is Jawabu Qasam. Ma anta bi niyamati rabbika bi majnoon. Oh, Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, with the mercy and blessings of your Lord, you haven't gone mad. You haven't gone mad. Majnoon. Wa inna laka lajran ghaira mamnoon. Yeah, see here yeah, now. This is a jumla. Ismiya. So it has to be emphasized with inna and lam uzalaka. Wa inna laka. This is the prophet. Prophet. La ajran ghaira mamnoon. Without cessation, your ajar will never end. And this is the most beautiful. Most beautiful. Wa inna ka la ala khulukin azim. Yes, our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam has, has the most exalted character of all human beings. I don't say that. Allah says that. Wa inna ka, the ka is the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Wa inna ka la ala, huh? this is another talkid, talkid of inna and lamu muzallaka. Inna ka la ala khulukin. Azim, did you see that idea? Well, this is she. Are you? Do you see all that thing? I thought I should mention it because this is my favorite. Huh? Okay. Now, I want to tell you a little joke now. Huh? When people are asked or they are pointed out, instructed, or advice to learn Arabic, uh, they say, no, no, no. It is not my cup of tea. So I made a little song, you know. It is a joke. Huh? Sab kuch sikha maine na sikhi Arabi I learn everything in this world. Wherever there is money to be made, I learned everything. I did my bachelor's, master's, PhDs, became engineer, lawyer. Sabukuchi si ka maine na siki Arabi. I learned everything except Arabic. Why? Such a dunya wallo. Oh, people, it is true. What is true? Such a hai dunya wallo. Ke hum hai kasalanu. It is true. I did not learn Arabic. I learned everything. Why did not I learn Arabic? Because I'm a lazy kasalanu. I'm a lazy. I thought I mentioned it, you know. I haven't mentioned this for a long time. Sab kuch sikha maine na sikhi Arabi. Sach hai dunya walo ke hum hai kaslanu. Alhamdulillah. Now we start. Huh? Clear Quran. Reassuring the Prophet, that the title from Clear Quran. What duha? See, what duha? Clear Quran by the morning sunlight. Duha means morning sunlight. Dr. Mohorali, by the brightness of the sun, by the bright morning hours. You see, only by, by, by. Iman Taurus, by the bright morning sunlight. 
it doesn't say I swear. Huh? But in Arabic, we say, we swear. Huh? So, wow, wow, wo harfo jarrin wa kasamin. Huh? Doha, doha. This is always harfo jarrin wa kasamin. Babni nala fata. Doha. Ismun majrurun bil waw wa alamatu jarri kasratun mukaddaratu li ta'zuri. Because you cannot put, you cannot make this majrur put kasra anywhere. It is mukaddara. Huh? It is mukaddara. Because when the noun ends with waw or ya, we cannot put kasra. We cannot put kasra, you know. Li ta'adzuri, ta'adzuri because of difficulty. Kasratul mukaddara to estimated kasra is there. We cannot put kasra. What, why reason, what is the reason? Li ta'adzuri, difficulty. Wa jarun wa majrurun wa ta'alikun bi fi'alin ma'zufi Takdiruhu I swear this thing is there. This thing is there. Every time there is a kasam, this uksimu or nuksimu is there. Uksimu, nuksimu, then Allah swears in his majesty, you know. So then uh, another kasam, the Wailaili Ida Saja. And by the night, only by, by, huh? And by the night when it falls still, Iman Taurus, and by the night when all is still, Dr. Mohorali, and by the night when it becomes, when it becomes tranquil, 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 I beg your pardon, it becomes tranquil, it becomes dense and calm, you know, tranquility, yeah. So again, same. Now here, that was Vawul Kasam. This is Harfu Atfin. Walayli. Huh? Walayli, now. Walayli ismun motufatun ala doha. Yeah. Ismun motufun ala doha. That goes to doha. Huh? Attached with doha. Majrurun wala motujarri kasratu. Now here there is a proper kasra. Mautufatun ala duha. It is it is attached with the duha. Iza Iza zarfu zamanin mujarrad min mana shart mabnin ala sukun fi mali naspin mutalikun bi fialil kasimil mukaddari. Wahua muda. Okay, Iza normally is you start a shart, but this is zarf, zarfu zamanin mujarrad, devoid min mana shart. It has no meaning of shart. Mabnun Allah sukun fi mahali nasmin mutalikun bi fiel fiel kasmil mukaddari. Wa huwa mudaf. This is your muda. Wa saja. Wa layli idha saja. Fiyalu madin. Babnun ala fata al mukaddara. See again, same. Fiyalu madin. Babnun ala fata hil mukaddari. Li taadzuri. Difficulty. You cannot put fata here. Another fata. Fiyalu madin. You cannot put fata on ya. So here, my brother, dear brothers and sisters. So then, the, the file. Where is the file? Damirun, mustatirun, jawazan, takdiru, hu, 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 yaudu ala layl. 
فعل ليل يعود ولا ليل وجملة في معل جر مضاف له في الفعل the جملة becomes مضاف له of إذا now these are the two قسم swearing والدوها والليل إذا سجى two swearings and then here begins جوابو قسم and there is a قسم the جواب has to be emphasized emphasized جواب has to be emphasized we must remember the rules of governing جوابو قسم the rules governing جوابو قسم very important maybe I should go here see here this is the handout uh, prepared by doctor by brother Zahid Naim October 2nd 2012 he prepared it he has prepared over 25 beautiful beautiful colorful uh, handouts uh, so this is this has nine pages these are nine pages I've discussed this sometimes with you but I'm not going to discuss now uh, there are nine pages it is exceptionally beautiful handout so you should try to first read page number three four and five i will send you this again and that will polish your knowledge of the jawabu kasam jawabu kasam you get it inshallah the oath in the Quran is a profound literary masterpiece. Yes. So here comes the jawab and the rules should apply. One rule is as we did, ma anta bi niyamati rabbika bi you know, if there is a negation, nothing is to be emphasized. Leave it alone. So here we have a negation. What doha? Wa layli iza saja. Ma waddaaka rabbuka wa ma kala. See here is a negation. It's a negation, so we cannot put any emphasis here, any emphasis. Ma vaddaaka rabbuka wa ma kala. So, what is the translation? Your Lord, O Prophet, has not abandoned you, nor has he become hateful of you. See, because there was a period of several months, maybe, we don't know, that no revelation came and people started taunting prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam that your 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 god has abandoned you abandoned you so so here is the translation ma vaddaaka rabbuka wa ma kala this is jumla failure and it is a negation so, Jawabu Kasam, and it is a negation. So, no emphasis, no, no emphasis of any kind. Your Lord, O Prophet, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, has not abandoned you. Vadda. Vadda means to say goodbye, farewell. And Ma Kala, Kala means to hate. Iman Taurus, your Lord has not forgotten you, has not 
Mahavadda Akayas, your Lord has not forgotten you, we say abandoned you, and he's not displeased with you. That is the idea of this, but it's a negation. Morally, Dr. Morally, there has not there has not taken leave of your Lord, nor is he displeased, you know. There has not taken leave of your Lord, nor he is displeased, you know. It negatives the supposition, yes. It negatives the supposition of the unbelievers about him, Prophet, because of a temporary pause in the coming of the Wahi. That was the reason. Ma, okay, Arfu Nafiyan, Mabnunara Sukun, what the to he took leave, bid you farewell, what the Alvida, farewell. Wow, okay, Ma, no, there is no wow here. This is part of what the you what the you form two. What the fellow Madin Mabnunala Fata, yes. Wakaf is the Sulsalal also. Damirun Mutasilun Mabnunala Fata, Fimali, Nasmin of Fulunbi. This is Yama Fulunbi. Rabbu, yes, that is the five. Ma vadda ka rabbu ka, your Lord. Rabbu fa'ilun marfun wa lamatu rafi dhamma. Ka al-kaf dhamirun muttasilun mabniun ala fata fi ma'li jar mudaf ilayhi. So this is mudaf, mudaf ilayhi. But jimlatu la ma'al laha min al-airaab jawabu al-kasam. Yeah, this is jawabu al-kasam. But jimlatu uslubi al-kasam. لا مهل لها من الإعراب ابتدائية This is the beginning وما قلا Now here the wow is حرف أتفين ما again حرف نافين وبن الله سكون قلا قلا He became displeased detested قلا also means to roast something roast you know you we do uh, barbecue or something. So kala, but here the meaning is to be, he be, became displeased, detested. Fiyanu maadin mabnun ala fatahil mukaddari li ta'adzuri again. Fiyanu maadin mabnun ala fatah. So there is another fatah here, brother. There is a fata here. I'm just writing with a circle. We cannot put because of a ya. A file, damirun mustatirun jawazu takdiru huwa rabbu is the file. A jumlatu la mail laha min al araf, mautufatun ala jawabu kasam. These are all mautufatun ala jawabu kasam. Because Huzifa Damiru min kala, ay ma kala ka. It should have been ma kala ka, but it's not mentioned. It's not mentioned. Fine. Al ma'ana. <laughs> These are beautiful things that are mentioned. If this is easy, I, I try to try to figure out the meanings and everything. Now you will get it. You will also figure out, huh? inshallah. Al Mahana Ma Tarakaka Tarakaka. Tarakaka Rabuka. Your Lord has not abandoned you, Ya Muhammad. Vuma Kataka Katal Maudi. Not even he has 
that is cut off from saying farewell. No, there is nothing like that. Bhama Kariyaka, and he does not hate you. And he does not hate you. Ruh and Wahil Ta'akhuri and Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam Ayyaman. Because of the transmission of the Wahi, Ta'akhur, late, Ta'akhara, and Rasulullah. The Wahi came late to the Prophet, Ayyaman, many, many days. Fakal al Mushrikuna, yes. Now these are the words of the Mushrikun. Inna Muhammadan Waddahu Rabbuhu, yes. Inna Muhammadan. Vadda who Rabbu, his Lord has says, farewell to him. Wa kalahu, kalahu, and he hates it. Wa kila, inna umma jamilin. Yeah, <laughs> here is there is a little history. Inna umma jamilin, verily, the mother of Jamil. Who's Jamil? Who's Umma Jamil? Imratu Abi Lahabin, yes. This, the very staunch enemy of Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And his wife, in Umma Jamilin, Imratu Abi Lahabin, Kalat, she said, Ya Muhammad, Ma ara shaitanaka illa kad tarakaka. I don't see shaitan, your shaitan, except that he has abandoned you. No, he's talking about the, the sending of the Vaid by Jibril. So she said, shaitan, huh? terrible, terrible. Ma araka shaitanaka. I don't see your devil, illa, except tarakaka that he has abandoned you. Anzala Allahu Ta'ala wa duha. And so Allah Swanu Ta'ala sent down this beautiful surah wa duha. I hope you like it. Inshallah you will be able to read it. Now Jawabu Kasam continues. Huh? Jawabu Kasam continues. And the next life is certainly far better for you than this one. Iman Taurus, and the time to come will be better than the past. No, I, I like this better. Huh? See, when you say next life, I always felt that Allah will abundantly bless in this life everything that a person can think of. And walal akhiratu khairun laka min al ula, previous or later on. Walal akhiratu khairun min al ula, from the beginning, the later time. No. And indeed, the, le the afterlife shall be better for you than the first. No, I don't agree with that, but scholars can write everything, whatever they want. Next surah that we'll study will prove that Prophet ﷺ was blessed in this life everything. Uh, of course, in Akhira, his status will be very high. He will be among the Mukarrabins, honorable position. But even in this life, that is what we will learn next time, inshallah. Alam Nasharaka, Anam Nasharaka, Sadraka. Wadana Anka Alam. Yes. Anyway, I I will will do next time. 
علم نشرا کا نش نشرا کا سدرا کا ڈیڈ ناٹ بی ایکسپینڈ یور چیسٹ اینڈ فیل دٹ وتھ نالج ودانا ان کا وزرا کا الذی ان کا دا ظاہرا کا اینڈ لوک ایٹ اٹ ورفانا لک ذکرا کا دیٹ از دا نیکسٹ ون اینڈ وی میڈ یور ریمبرنس we spread your remembers throughout the world rafana laka zikraka your mention we put it very high in this world everybody talks about prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam the one human being everybody talks about most of the time inshallah we all talk about prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam So now that we will do next time, inshallah. So this is, that is why I say here that uh, I, I like Iman Taurus and the time to come will be better than your past time. So here, walal akhiratu khairun laka min al Now we have to see. La. Uh, This is emphasis. This emphasis is called Lamu Ibtida. If the Jumla is Ismiya, there is a Muftida in Khabar. The Muftida has to be uh, emphasized with the Lamu Ibtida. Uh, this, this Lam is called Lamu Ibtida for emphasis, for emphasizing the job of Qasam, you know. Well, that is the Lam. Akhiratu, later part. The later part of your life will be better in the present world. I write down here, present world. The next surah explains it. Yes, I again mention it. The next surah explains it. Okay. Now this, this sentence is a Jumla Ismiya. We have to understand, most important to understand and always to keep in mind, figuring out, is it Jumla Ismiya or is it Jumla Failia? The Jawabu Qasam, what is it? What is it? Jawabu Qasam, what is it? Huh? So here we come, Vau, Atifatun, Au Istanafiyatu, La, Lamu Ibtida, for emphasizing the job of Qasam because it is Jumla Ismiya, this is Muftida, this is Khabar, Walal Akhiratu Khairun. Okay. Walal Akhiratu Muftida. Walamu Lamu Ibtidai Harfu Mabnun Ala Fata. Yes, see, Mabnun Ala Fata. Walal Akhiratu Muftida. Marfoon wala matu rafi damma. Damma. So here, and then if the akhiratu is mubtida, where is the khabar? Khairun is your khabar. Ismu tafdeel. Khairun. And Sharun, there are two words. They can be used in singular, in comparative degree, and superlative degree. Uh, so here, it is not a superlative degree. Reason, Min has come. When Min comes, then it is always comparative degree. Uh, comparative degree. See, I have written here, ismu tafdil means uh, comparative degree because of min following it here. Min is following it, so it becomes comparative degree. Uh, so it will be better. Uh, better. Khairun, khabrun, marfun, alamatu rafi, damma. جملة من المبتدا وخبر لا محل لها من العراب 
Mautufatun ala jumlatil jawabi kasham. These are all connected with the jawabu kasham. And then I, 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 I ignore this, you know. But takunu alamu li tawkid. Yes, this lam is for tawkid. Walaysat lil kasham. It's not for kasham. It's for tawkid. Laka alam harfujar. That lamb was, lamb was here, huh? La akhiratu. Walal akhiratu. Walal akhiratu. That lamb is for tawkid. Huh? Jo. Sure. O takunu alamu li tawkid. Walaysat lil kasam. Laka jar majur. Kaf, laka, al kaf damirun mutasilun mabnin ala fata fi mali jar bi lam, fajar un majrun mutalikun bi isam tafdil, yeah, this is isam tafdil, huh? yeah, isam tafdil, khair. Min, min change into min, mina, huh? min is harfu jarrin, mabnin ala sukun. Allazi hurrika mean change. Ila fata. Change into fata. Why? Manahan lil tikai sakinaini. To prevent the meeting of the two sukuns. So it became menal. It is men, but became menal. Hurrika means change. Allazi hurrika. Alula. The first part of your life. The later part of your life will be better. Ismun majrurun bi men, walamatul jarri, kasratul mukhadaratul li ta'adzuri. Again, you cannot put kasra here. Difficulty, impossibility, li ta'adzuri. Wajarun wa majrurun, mutalikun bismit. Tafdil khair. Again, job kasam continues. And surely your Lord will give you so much to you that you will be pleased. And surely your Lord will give so much to you that you will be pleased. Iman Tori, soon your Lord will give it to you and you will be satisfied. Morally and surely there will be, there will give you your Lord. There will give you your Lord, so you will be pleased. Again, Harfu Atfin, again this is Lamu Litauki, La, because this is the way it is coming, it is coming as a Shumla. Ismiya. Safa came, so then you have to only give Lamu Taqid here to Safa. Well, Lamu, Lamu Ibtida, Taqid, for Taqid. Harfun, Babnu Nala Fata, yes. But Safa, Harfu, Istikbalin, Babnu Nala Fata. So far, you tika, yes, you tika. Now here, many things are mentioned. I also try to mention something. See, when the scholars do grammatical analysis, uh, two different people will think in a different way to emphasize, uh, to correct, picture of grammatical analysis to give you a correct picture of grammatical analysis. So this is yutika, ata, form four, yuti, he gives, he bestows, he grants. I have written here, he gives something to someone. So two mafulun bi, two objects. 
he gives something to someone. So, takes two objects. This is from the dictionary. Yotika ka is one object, Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and Khairan, yeah, Yutika, Khairan, he'll be given the best. Huh? So Yuti, Fialun, Mudarion, Marfum, Alamatu, Rafid, Damatul, Mukaddara, basically for heaviness. Ulkaf, Tamirul, Mutasilun, Mabnun, Allah, Fata, Fimali, Nasmin, Mafulun, Bihi. Here, this is not mentioned. And this is, I mentioned it because I read it. You take a Rabbu, Rabbu is the fire. Rabbu is the fire. Marfun wala maturafi damma. Bahuwa mudaf. Bakaf, Rabbu ka. Will be manager mudafilehi. Mudafilehi also. Babu nala fatafi manager. Jar. Ka is a damir. Babu nala fata is mudafilehi. But Jumlatu min fiel wa file fi mali rafin. Khabrulli Mubtida Mahzuf Takadiru. Now here comes the way the scholar wants to say it. Wa la anta wa la anta. See here comes Saufa la anta Saufa Yutika. So la anta came. Fine, that's also fine. So la came in the beginning. Lamu. Uh, okay, fine. So you will you like or you like you are pleased you are satisfied agree approve about the what Allah will give you you will be satisfied you will be pleased you will like it and you will agree and approve what Allah gives you so that is the radia yarda so now fa alfau atifatun Tarda, Felun, Mudarion, Marfun, Walamatu, Rafi, Damatul, Mukadaru, Litadzuri, yes. Because of difficulty of impossibility, difficulty of putting Dhamma there. Damatul Mukaddara, so we say it is Mukaddara. My eyes cannot see, but the eyes of my mind can see, yeah, there is a Dhamma there. So I put a Dhamma here. Okay, with a circle, so that you know that is Mukaddara. It's not to be written, just to be understood. A file, Damirun, Mustatirun, Wujuban, Takdiru, Anta, Prophet, a Jumlatu, Fimali, Rafin, Mautufatun, Allah Jumlati, Yotika Rabuk, Yotika Rabuk, goes back, inshallah. Alam yajidka yati man fa'awa. Here are beautiful, beautiful verses, inshallah. We'll complete it, inshallah. I may take five minutes extra. Alam yajidka yati man fa'awa. Now, this is all favors of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam received a lot of favors from Allah. And Allah looked after him. Looked after him. And everything, now all those favors to Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam are being discussed to tell Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam that, that, that Allah has not forgotten you. Allah does not dislike you. Did he not find you an orphan? Alam yajidka yatiman. 
then shelter you for Ava. Huh? Beautiful. Huh? Iman Taurus, did he not find you an orphan and gave you shelter? Favor of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Morally, did he not find you an orphan and then gave you gave shelter? Uh, now, you know, uh, I would rather be satisfied with Alhamdulillah Istifam, but the scholars go deep sometimes and they mention, so we have no choice but to understand Karrara Takriri. This is Hamza Lil Istifam, interrogation, but it is affirmation, affirmation. Confirmatory, con confirmatory, definitive, conclusive. These are all the meaning of. These are all the meaning of. Takriri, harfun, mabnun alafata, mabnun alafata. Lam harfun nafin wa jazmin wa kalbin, mabnun ala sukun. Lam vajidka, vajada. Yajidu lam yajid ka lam yajid ka ka hasumi mafurun bihi vajada to find did he not find you an orphan so yajid my brother and sister fielun mudarion majizumun bi lam the lam will make fiel mudaria majizum Balamatu Jasmi Sukun, yes, that's easy. Sukun. Rafael Damirun Mustatirun Jawazan Takadiru Huwa. Mustatir. Who is that? Mustatir, who is it? Huwa. I always want to find out that. So I have Fakhruddin Kabawa's work. I check it. He will always explain. Takdiru huwa yaudu ala rabbu. Yeah, that huwa goes to the rabb. Huwa goes to the rabb. Wa jumlatu la ma'al laha min al-airab istinafiyatu. An-niyama Allah Ta'ala ala Sayyidina his, his blessings to uh, Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Well, kaf, the kaf is damirun mutasirun mabnin ala fata fi mali nasmin mafulun bihi. See, damair are all mabni. So we have to explain fi mali nasmin jarrin rafin. So here fi mali nasmin mafulun bihi. Mafulun bihi, so mali nasmin. Yatiman, orphan, mafulun bi sani. Huh? So here we have Vajada has to he find you in, in certain position. He find you in certain position. Yatiman, orphan, mafulun bi sani. Mansubun walama to the Nasbi Dhamma. Awa, fa'awa, fa'awa. Awa Al Fau Atifatun. What is Awa Form 4? UV to provide refuge shelter. Awa is to provide refuge shelter. Awa Felu Madin Mabnula Fatatil Mukadara La Fatatil Fatahil Mukadara Mabnuna La Fatahil Mukadari Litazuri. You cannot put Fatah here. You cannot put fatah here. Rafail, Tamirun, Mustatirun, Jawazan, Takdiru Huwa, Yaudu Allah, Rab. Fail is Rab. The Rab, your Rab gave you shelter. But Jumlatu, La Melha Min Al Arab, Botufun Allah Jumlatu, Yajid, before. And then 
وجدك دالا فهدا سيم ايديا سيم ايديا did he not find you unguided then guided you dalan then guided you iman torus writes very beautifully here did he not find you lost and showed you the way and showed you the way the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam this is all iman torus is writing never worshiped idols as a child or young person although although almost everyone around him did everyone around the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam did worship idols but rasul sallallahu alaihi wasallam as a child or in a as a young person he did not but still he was without true guidance uh, even though he did not worship idols but he still was lacking the true guidance but still he was without true guidance this is all iman tourist in religion and therefore lost he was lost until allah revealed to him the straight way yes. allah guided him until allah revealed to him the straight way beautifully written by iman tourist you know? so morally and he found you away from the way huh? he found you away from the way then showed you the way <laughs> beautiful dr morally huh? and he found you away from the way then showed you the way huh? so wow again same atifatun wajada firu madin nabdin ala fata yes daminun ka Jawazan. No, this is what is ka? No, here yeah, we are still here. Vajada, we have to say file. Fiel comes. There has to be a file. File. Damirun mustatirun jawazan takdiru huwa yaudu ala rabbu wa jumlatu la mahlaha min al arab mautu fatun ala jumlatu alam yajid ka wa kaf. Now this kaf is explained here. Well, kaf damirun mutasilun mabdin ala fata fi mali nasbin mafurun bihi awal. This is Rasul Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Dalan away from the way, erring, gone astray. Dalan is ismu file. From Dalla, active participle. Dalan mafulun bi sani, mansubun malamatu nasbi fata, fahada. This is mafulun bi sani. Fahada, fahar alfau atifatun hada. Si hada fielu madin mabnun ala fata. Fata hil mukaddari di taazuriya. So I I can write down. A fata here, but I'll put it in a circle. Remember, it is, it is just for understanding us. There is, we don't have this thing there. We don't, we don't keep this thing. The file, the mirun, musatirun, jawadun, takdir huwa. The file is always yauzu ala rabbu. Allah guided him. Jumlatu la malha min al arab. Watu fatun ala jumlatu. Wajada, fine. Wa wajada ka ailan fa agna. Clear Quran. And did he not find you needy? Then satisfy your needs. Clear Quran. And did he not find you needy? Ailan. And then satisfy your needs, Iman Torres. Did he not find you in need and enriched you? Yeah, Agna enriched you. And here is something I wrote it down. 
الفايل لوجد واغنى there will be two verbs agna form 4 agna is form 4 wajada two verbs uh, the file of both of them are mustatir taqdiru huwa yawdu ala rab yeah. it is the rab who find you uh, poor and then enriched you. Wajadaka Ailan Ailan Pagna, and then he enriched you. So Ailan, brother and sister, is coming from Ala Yailu. Ala Yailu. To be poor. Ismu file Ailan. Poor, needy. Huh? Did he not find you poor and then enriched you? Agna, to be rich, to be free from want. Enriched, made rich. Huh? Agna. Huh? So then, again, my brothers and sisters, it says, Alayatul Sabikatu, previous one. The Arab is like the previous one, you know. Alhamdulillah. <clears throat> yes. So this is Mafulun B number one, Mafulun B number two. Fagina. So this is your uh, this is your <clears throat> comes so he enriched you so he enriched you so he enriched you for agana so he enriched for hada so that is it Hada is just the verb. Same here, agina. Amma. Now the here is something new. This is a new thing has come. So we have to we have to understand this. When Amma comes, it's called harfu shartin wa tafsilin wa tawqidin. Amma harfu shartin wa tafsilin wa tawqidin. Naibatun anil ismil sharti wa fiali. Mama yakun shayun. So whatever the case may be, whatever the uh, matter may be, whatever the matter may be, Amma is like that. So, so do not oppress the orphan. So do not oppress the orphan. Iman Torah. So, as for the orphan, yeah, that is what Amma will always say. As for the orphan, it comes from Amma. Do not be harsh with him. So there is, there is a beautiful thing. You will like it. I have done all my homework. So Amma comes, you know. So what is Amma? Amma is harfu shartin. There is a sharta. Vatafsilin vataukidin. Amma yatima. Fa comes fa. What is fa? Yes, the fa is alfau vakiyatu vakiyatun fi jawabi amma. Yes, so fa will come as a jawab of amma. Arpun mabni nala fata. So that is will come from now onwards to the, the three three times I think. Fa ammal yatima fa la takhal. So this is your 
حرفو تفصیلین و شرطین and then فا is coming here الفاو واقعیتون في جواب اما حرفون مبنون الافتا and then ولا نایتو من الجواز مداریا حرفو مبنون الاسکون سو فلا سو لا is a لامو نایتون it is make it مجزوم لا نایا من جواز مو Mudariya, from the particles that will give fail mudariya majizum, jawadimu mudariya, harfu mabrina la sukun la, so sukun hiya, walla hiya, this la nahiya will make it majizum. Fala takhar, yes, okay, so la takhar, let us read it, amma, we got it. Amma, al-yatima, orphan, mafulun bi, mukaddam, advance, mansubun balamatu nasbi fata, munasibuhu, and what will make it mansub, takahar, munasibuhu, takahar. فلا تكهر أما اليتيمة فلا تكهر سفا إسفاو واقيتون في جواب أما أرف مبني لا فتا ولا ناهية هي أريد أن أقول لا ناهية so تكهر means do not treat harshly Persecute, overpower, takhar, felun mudariyon, majuzumun billa, walamatu jazmi sukun, wa fail, damirun, mustatirun, ujubun, takdiru anta. Now, this I wrote down here, anta, which is actually Prophet Salallahu Alaihi Wasallam, because he is being addressed, but I say that it addresses all of us. It applies to every one of us. Everything here applies to every one of us. So when you see an orphan, don't be harsh. Don't treat him harshly. Persecute, overpower. That is good enough, inshallah. Again. And not repulse the beggar. Iman Taurus, clear Quran, short. Iman Taurus, and the beggar, do not send him away <laughs> empty. <laughs> and then, very beautiful. Huh? And the beggar, do not send him away empty handed. No. Give him something. Dr. Morally, uh, as for the beggar, do not drive him away. Do not drive away. So again, wow. Again, no, there is not much here. So we will say, you know, wow. And then Amma, same thing that we did it. Fala, see here, Amma, Harfu, Tafsil. وشرط، and this is the فا جواب، جواب from أم أمّا and فا، okay fine. تنهار is drive away. وأما بنعمة ربك فحدث yes and proclaim the blessings of your Lord. clear Quran. And proclaim the blessings of your Lord. Very short, but Iman Torres is good. And Dr. Mahorali is good. As for your Lord's beautiful gifts, yeah, it was always, Amma means as far, as far. Huh? See here, Amma harfut tafsilin vashart, 
of Nirala Sukun. So it will translation will be as far. And then, then we will have a be in the fa. Fa. Where is the fa coming? Fa, yeah. This is your alfao vakiatun fijabi amma. This goes to amma. Remember, always. So then when you see is the amma, then the jawab of Amma, Fa. As for the blessings of your Lord, Fahad this. Now this is very important. Huh? I have seen it and I was shocked when people say something that I did not agree. And proclaim the blessings of your Lord. Fahad this. Iman Taurus. And as for as for your Lord's beautiful gifts, speak of them to others. Speak to them of others. So, Dr. Morali, and as for the grace of your Lord, relate. Uh, relate means remember, mention on, mention. Remember, mention, and express gratitude. Yes, that is important. Gratitude. Huh? So, Vamma, Vau Atifatun, Amma, Harfu, Tafsilin, Vashartin, Mabdinullah, Sukun. This is your Amma, remember? So, it's all there, inshallah. By the time the recording comes and you go through it, you will have a fair idea of the new things that we are learning today, inshallah. I will send you the uh, recording tonight. Inshallah. And I have a request. If it is over one hour and 45 minutes, yes, I think one hour and 45 minutes. So then break it down in small parts, you know. Even I watch it again, but I watch it in parts, you know. Half an hour, 45 minutes, stop. Note the time, then go back. So we have niyamat, niyamati, grace, favors, blessing. Albao harfujarin. Albao harfujarin. Niyamati is a majur will ba, wala madhujari, kasra, vajar, majur. Kutalikun bi haddis. Maniyamatu mudaf rabbi bi harfchar isam majrur wa mudaf mudaf ilahi wa mudaf and finally mudaf ilahi. Rabbi mudaf ilahi wa huwa mudaf al kaf mudaf ilahi. Oh, there's still, still, yeah, there's more, more to come. For huh? this, this foul, al fao vakiyatun fijabu amma. Al fao vakiyatun fijabi amma. So, had this, speak, report, relate. Dr. Morali says, remember, mention and express gratitude to Allah. At this, Fialu Amrin Mabrin Allah Sukun. Fail Damirun Mustatirun Ujuban Takdiru Anta. Bajumlatu fi me Bajumlatu la me la min al Arab, Motu Fanala, Jumlatu Tanhar. Now, all these things are written here. I thought. I should explain you. Huh? Niyamatun means, you know, blessing, favor, grace. Very important. Very important. Niyamatun, singular, blessing, favor, grace. What is the plural? Niyamun, yes. 
This is your plural, Miamun, Miamun. Amarahu subhanahu wa ta'ala with tahadusi. Tahadusi means talking, speaking, relating. Bi niyamin lahi. Bi niyamin. Plural. Favors, grace. Favor, grace. Pleasure of Allah to speak about it, talk about it, relate about it. But is har ha lannasi and show display but is har ha lannasi. What is har ha bainahum and promul promulgation, announcement, declaration between two. But tahaddusu bi niyamati Allah ta'ala shukran and express your thanks to Allah to talk, to speak, to relate by niyamati Allah shukran. Wakila, no, this is your punchline. Huh? This is your punchline, you know. This is your punchline. Yeah. Home run, huh? Niyamatu huna Quran al Karim. Niyamatu, the blessing, grace here. Niyamatu huna al Quran al Karim. Fammarahu an yakrahu wa yuaddisu. That we should narrate and talk about it. Yuaddisu, bihi about it. Huh? Wa amarahu ayyakara Allah has ordered to us to, to read it and narrate it. Yakara, who, who is Quran? And be Quran again, or you had this to discuss. That is the end, my brothers and sisters. Alhamdulillah. I hope you like it. Now, the thing that I am hesitating to say, it, but I will not get in. I, I have seen people, not in Canada, I don't think so, I have not seen, but in, in uh, India, Pakistan, people, they spend so much money on wedding and receptions. The whole buildings are lighted up and the food is flowing, you know. And brother, why are you doing all this thing? Huh? Can't you be a little moderate in celebration of your, the wedding? Oh, I know your son is getting married or your daughter is getting married, but we have to be moderate. What was the answer? <laughs> Show to your ni'matillahi. <laughs> that was the answer. I thought it was not right. Instead, if you open an orphanage or a school or a hospital or anything that will comfort those who are needy, who those who are poor, those who are orphans, they are look after. Schools is the best thing. An orphanage is another best thing. In the world, people are poor. So if God has given us money, we should show the blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by doing these things. These will reward and make Allah reward the moment a lot and will make Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala very happy. You will find the happiness of your attitude and pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. I thought I mentioned it. Alhamdulillah, my brothers and sisters. So now, we let us pray. Please join me in the prayers, dear brothers and sisters. 
May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept your sacrifice of time to study and understand the Quran, the Arabic language as hasanat in your scale of good deeds in this world as well as your mulkiyama. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless you all, your spouses and your children with excellent health, barakas in your risk, in your jobs, in your businesses, in your careers, in your profession, in your education, and in the education of your children. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all with a strong memory and deep knowledge of Arabic to understand in depth the message of the Quran so that we all feel the miracle of the Quran in our hearts. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala enlighten our homes and our families with the light of the Quran and instill this light in our children. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala keep us all safe and protected from the evil of this virus and natural calamities. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect the Muslim Ummah all around the world, wherever they may be residing from the evil of this virus and natural calamities. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect the humanity at large from the evil of this virus and natural calamities. See you next Sunday, inshallah, my brothers and sisters. Keep safe, stay healthy, and follow the guidelines of the health authorities. And observe, and observe physical distancing. Rabbana, atina fi dunya hasanatu, wa bil akhirati hasanatu, wa kina azaban naar. Rabbana, hablana min azwajina wa zuriyatina kurrata ayuni wa jahalna lil muttakina imama. Rabbana, takabal minna innaka antas samiyul alim wa tubu alayna innaka antat tawabu rahim. Subhana rabbika rabbil izzati amma yasifuna wa salamu ala al mursaleen. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. See you next Sunday, inshallah, my brothers and sisters. You have a good uh, time uh, with your families and friends. And uh, stay healthy. Listen to the recording there when it comes tonight. That's all to say. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.